Over the past few decades, the number of women in the workforce has increased dramatically, thankfully, and yet there's still work to be done to achieve gender equality in the office. Research shows almost half of women don't feel confident asking their employer about flexible work, while more than a quarter say they don't have a senior female role model in their business. Joining me now is a woman who loves to work. Maureen Forbes is 81. I hope she doesn't mind me saying that. She looks <laughs> amazing. Still serving breakfast twice a week at the Hilton Hotel in Brighton. Hello, Dr. Dr. Hi, how are you? You look amazing. Thank you. Um, tell really me about nice. your job. Oh, my job is in hospitality, as you know. Yeah. And I'm the breakfast hostess. Um, we get in there early in the morning because our first guests arrive at 6.30. What time do you get up? I'm usually there about quarter to six. Up amazing. I start quarter to six. Wow. So, so you're up really after, nice. before five o'clock then? Oh, you yeah. get up before five? Yeah, well before. Yeah. Goodness. Yeah, so it's quite good. Um, yeah, nice. there, there's, there's quite a lot to do before five o'clock in I the bet. morning. You know, we've got to get the restaurant prepared and things like that. But have you ever had a Hilton breakfast? Yeah. I well, have. Yeah, you'll Plenty have to come. It. To, you'll I have bet to it's come not as good as Brighton. you want, though, is it? Yeah, I'm looking forward. Why are you still working at 81? Do you not deserve a lion now? No. Why no not? No one deserves a lion. Okay. You need to get up and do it. We're strong women. That's what we're talking about, isn't mm -hmm. it? Okay. And um, the good thing about it is if I need time off, I can get time off. You're talking about flexi hours. I mean, that's what stood me in good stead over the years. Mm because with the family, uh, school and different things, I always had. So if you give notice, you can work according to your notice once you can get your shifts covered. You know, so what you're saying, uh, Maureen, is that it's really important to, be fle to, to have flexible working for women, especially yes, when is. they're bringing up their children. And Without feeling guilty about it, mm -hmm. that's what I felt. And I feel loyal to the Hilton because of this, because they made it easy for me, to even in the old days, it's still made Has it, it easy. changed, Maureen, over the years? Do you think? A lot of things have changed. Obviously, mm -hmm. they've got younger managers for a start. We got very. Um... Are they getting younger managers? Or is it just because we're getting older? Oh, that's a bit nasty. <laughs> no, it's not. It's all because I'm getting older too. Well, we all are. Let's, yeah, hope, we, let's hope we survive this I lot. I think I was a pup when I started at Sky, and now they're all coming up, and they're younger than my son. Yeah, we've got a young. This is what I love about my job is I'm watching the youngsters come in at 16 all like skittish cultish kids that hates their mother still and don't like authority and they come in and remember they're starting work and the first thing they do in the morning is see 100 people walk through the door mm. you know so then they start to thinking this is a job <laughs> you yeah. know and they do an apprenticeship yeah yeah. Do you think it's easier for women now than it was when you first started? Have it you all depends. For women? It all depends on the men they're working with. A lot of it, right? You know, if the men are senior and not flexible, then it's very hard for the women to make their mark. Mm. You know, I mean, um, when I first started at the Hilton, the gen you said good morning, sir, to the general manager, and now. The general manager could say, "Hi, Sasha. How are you this morning?" Yeah, it's entirely different. I thought you were going to say the general manager is a woman now. <coughs> Fun. I thought you were going to say the general manager is a woman. Oh, we've had them. Good. Yeah, glad had... to hear it. Glad yeah. to hear it. Tell me about um, some of the interesting requests that you've had over the years for breakfast. Interesting requests. I bet you've had some, haven't you? We've had weird. We've had like I only do breakfast, so obviously. Um, most of what they request is on the buffet anyway. Oh, okay. You know, I like a buffet, I have to say. Huh? I like a buffet. Yeah, so do I. Yeah, it's Especially easier, isn't one. it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How long do you yeah. think you're going to carry on working for? Um, I might try and do it till I'm 90 if I can. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And still twice so, a week? Yeah. What's your top tips for getting up early? Because I find it really hard. I've always got up early. Mm. I always do, I always have done. I get, I go to bed about half past ten, eleven o'clock, up quarter past half past four. So it's You don't nice. need any more sleep? I, no. And what do you think about people who are night owls? Is it much better being up early? Well, there's a lot of night owls, but it's alcohol night owls and <laughs> night owls, isn't there? <laughs>
<laughs> the alcohol ones are impossible in the morning. Well, I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> but you keep them in order, though, Maureen, don't you? Well, I try to. I'm sure you do it very efficiently. I've only efficiently. got so much power. <laughs> it's good to see you. Yeah. Thank you. And so you're going to carry on for another nine years at least. Well, no, no, For as long as you want to, <laughs> I'm sure they'll be thrilled to have you. Yeah, well, I'll be watching you now. Will you? Yeah. We can take your cup with you then. I'm going to, and I filled it with coffee, so Did I'm quite you? happy. Okay. I've had my face. Was made it warm up. enough? It was lovely. How was your breakfast? You've not had one yet. No, I'll make sure somebody yet. gets you one. Yeah. Okay. Nice to see you. Thank, Thank you, you so very much. much.